Hey yo, so if you couldn't tell by the title, this is going to be a studio vlog store prep type of video because I am super, super excited it's upside down that my sushi bee pins are finally here they are about one and a half inch double posted rainbow acrylic and i'm so happy with the way they turned out like, like look at all my babies these are my babies i waited so long for these and i'm so excited to hold them in my hand like this one's going on my pin board but i'm just holding it like oh it's my baby but yeah so today's video is going to be mostly about store prepping and not just for these but for a bunch of stuff i've been meaning to do for the past two weeks but i just haven't put these aside because they're further down on the list so i have a list of things i need to get done for this video for the studio vlog so it's currently monday the 25th that's how long i've been waiting to do this and i could have technically done some of this stuff beforehand but it's fine so the first things i had to do was to print off some more sushi bee stickers because I miscounted. I was like, you know what? I'll just print off more because I'll sell more. It's fine. Second thing I had to print off was backing cards for the sushi bees. And the cards came out a little smaller, but they fit perfectly. Like it worked out great. Third thing I had to print off, these stickers. These are stickers for my Patreon launching May 1st. Yep, that's right. I started a Patreon page where you can go and get extra support from me. My Patreon is going to have three tiers. One is a $1 support tier in case you just don't want anything. The second is a $3 sticker tier. This month is going to be this little frog with a little bluebell hat. It's so cute. And then the third tier is a $6 tier for an exclusive Patreon print, which on Patreon, I'm uploading extra speed paints, just one a month. But I will be showing the artwork publicly. This is the art that's going to be Patreon exclusive. And this will be print regular hand signed by me like normal. So I'm super excited for that launch. I don't have the link for it 100% ready. But if you go down to my description and go follow my Instagram, you'll know when that's live. Or you could just come back on May 1st. Now onto the rest of the list. Besides the printing, I also need to glitter hollow three pages of stickers. And then after I make and cut, then after I make and cut the stickers, I have to cut more of my little thank you cards I use for my Etsy orders. And I just figured if I'm doing it once, I'm just gonna do the rest of the sheets that I need to do for this time. I use this specific mermaid magical unicorn scrapbook sheets and i'm just trying to go through one of each design at a time so i'm like i'm just gonna do them all and then we cut out the backing cards prep all of the pins by unpacking them and pinning them onto their cards and then i have three etsy orders to pack including pre-orders i'm gonna be making reels of those for instagram i try to record every order and then make the listing for the sushi beats i have a feeling i'm not gonna get it all done tonight considering it is 9 24 at night but I'm gonna try, get most of it done. That's why I made a list, because my ADHD ass is not gonna be able to do this all from memory. And the sushi beef pins will be listed this Friday. Keep an eye out for that. I'm gonna stop talking, start cutting. Hello, voiceover Emily. I am so excited to actually be working on some stuff because I have been waiting for the sushi bee pins for about two weeks. They arrived a week later than I expected them to, which is not, it's, no one's fault. I just thought it would be a little faster. That's my own problem. But I did start to panic a little bit because I had orders, pre-orders that were due in literally two days of me sending them out. So I was like, oh, great. But it worked out. But the other big thing, obviously, is that I have a Patreon now, or I will be having a Patreon. And like I said, it's going to be starting on May 1st. And I wanted to talk a little bit more about that because that's one of the things that I put a lot of effort to these past two weeks while I was waiting on the sushi bees. So as I showed in the intro, I have the Patreon exclusive sticker and I have the Patreon exclusive artwork for the print. Now for the sticker, every month I'm going to be doing an animal design. Like if you would have told me a year ago, hey, you're going to really love drawing animals. I would have been like, you're, <laughs> you're fucking nuts. No, I don't know what it is, but just these past couple months, Anytime I draw like a little animal, like the sushi bee, I drew the frog for Patreon, anything up that alley, I'm like, wow, I'm in love with this. So for the print for Patreon for May, there's a duck pond up by my house. Well, I live on a dirt road. You go up the dirt road, you make a right, go up the hill, there's a duck pond. And every day I go on a walk and I walk past this pond and I send a picture of the ducks to my partner because they love ducks. So I was like, I'm going to paint the duck pond or at least some version of the duck pond. And for being somebody who doesn't really like, or who used to not like painting animals, this was really cute, and I really liked it. 
and I can't wait to do more paintings for Patreon. I figured I barely use my acrylic paints as is, and I don't like using my acrylic paints with like a sketch base. So I was like, I'm just gonna freehand it like I did with the ducks. I'm talking about the ducks as if you can see them. No, no. With my Patreon though, however, every tier you get to see extra speed paints. So isn't that fun? I'll go over the tiers and the prices too, just while I talking here because most of this is just store prep and stuff. So like I said before, there is a $1 support tier and I don't mail anything out for the $1 support tier. The only thing that's going to be on the support tier for a dollar a month, you get to watch an extra speed paint. There's no voiceover in these. Just figured I'd not bore the people who are paying for it. You know what I mean? I'll bore the people who, su who support me for free. Isn't that fun? And then sometimes I'm going to be doing some secret Etsy coupons. Like I can tell you right now, for August, there's going to be a good coupon because that's my birth month. So check Patreon for that. And then the next tier up is the sticker club tier. And that's for $3 a month. Normally my stickers are $3.50. But you get the 50 cent discount. Plus you're also going to be able to see the extra speed paint, secret Etsy coupons, and the sticker that's only going to be Patreon exclusive. And then the final tier is a $6 a month here and you get the sticker and you get a hand signed print of whatever the artwork for that month is and those prints will also only be patreon exclusive so like i said may is going to be the duck pond and the little froggy sticker and as for the rewards go i wanted it to have it a way that was like like let's i'm going to use may as an example because it's the only one i have if you sub if you subscribe to the patreon for May's rewards. I'll start shipping out May's rewards in the very beginning of June so that way I have everything in a list and I can bash it all out at once. I know some people do like, oh, if you subscribe in May, I'll send your stuff out in May. I applaud the people that can do that because I have the attention span of a fucking paperclip. So if you get it in May, in the beginning of June is when everything's going to be sent to us. Everything's going to kind of be like quote unquote one month behind, but you know what I mean. I'm also super new to the Patreon thing. And I'm really excited for it. Like, this is one of those things I said, I was like, oh, if I quit my job, I'm going to start doing Patreon. It was either that or selling feet pics online. The second one is still an option that's being brought up to me by other people for some reason. I never thought about the Patreon when I was working at my day job. Just because I was already on burnout. Like, between work and this crazy standard I had for myself where I had to create two to three new illustrations in my sketchbook a day. I mean, a week. Like, putting in the extra work for a Patreon and, like, focusing on that was not going to happen. So I was like, you know what? Screw it. Now that I have all the free time in the world, I'm going to make a Patreon. And I'm happy with it. And I think that's all I have to say about it. And just your support, your guys' support just means the absolute world to me. Because, yes, I'm technically self-employed, but I'm also an artist, so I'm naturally the family disappointment. Will you stop singing for, like, three seconds? I'm trying to have a moment. He's just so starved for attention. Like, yes, I've been home, but I can't take him out because my door needs to be open during the day. So, because I'm in the basement. And I need ventilation. And I can't take him out because we have cats. So he gets cranky when I start talking, whether it be to my partner, my friends, or even just my phone to do a voiceover. A little rant over. What I was going to say was that I'm happy with the Patreon. And speaking of me being happy with the way something came out, the Sushi V pins. You saw a couple weeks ago, I designed them myself. I even made the backing cards by myself. The only thing I had help with was, once again, come to the rescue, my friend Onijiri Art. Shout out to you. They're the ones who actually helped me get them made. I just sent them a photo file and said, here you go, group order time, I guess. I'm just really proud of them. And they're going to be listed tomorrow at around 10.30 or 10 o'clock. Honestly, it depends on what time I wake up because I've had no structure to my life since I quit. I feel like I had structure to start with. Like I was waking up at like 7, 8 o'clock. I used to wake up at 6 for work. Then I was like, oh, I'm going to wake up a little later. And then it started going from 7 o'clock to 8 o'clock. I slept till 10 o'clock the other day. Granted, I was up until 2.30, but still. And as you'll see later, I was up pretty late doing all this. But I'm proud of my ADHD ridden ass for getting everything on that list done. It didn't take as much time as I thought it would. That's why I had, <laughs> I also like to break my list down to every little minute thing, so. Oh, and the last, this last part, um, the big gaps in it, <laughs> it's kind of, when I was packing orders, whether it's big or small or whatever, I film all of my orders for Instagram Reels, diet TikTok, because I cannot commit myself to using actual TikTok. So that's why the 
timing on it, it's kind of weird. And I did the math. It took me eight minutes to pack one order because I was like, let's stop and record it. I also had to pull the envelope off to the side because I had to write down the woman's address. I mean, and I appreciate all the help. One sticker, a pin, a charm. Heck, I even threw a Pokemon card in my partner's package because they collect Pokemon cards. I don't. I buy them on impulse very, very rarely. And one of the times I pulled them, I said, wouldn't it be funny if I got a rainbow art? And then that's exactly what happened. I said I was going to give it to them and they told me no because I pulled it. I should keep it. So I threw it in as a freebie because I'm a good girlfriend. I think. I think I'm a good girlfriend. I'm going to go have a crisis now. <laughs> I'm kidding. Come back on May 1st. Come back on May 1st on my Instagram and go subscribe to my Patreon. The thing I forgot to mention is that Patreon, there's no limits on the support tier but for the other tiers there are 12 options each just because that's a round number for me to print off my stickers on completely honest so 12 sticker 12 sticker and print and if more and more people want it i'll start making more slots available i need to edit this down this went from 16 minutes let's see how long this video is i also had to stop a lot because somebody couldn't stop being a chatterbox i'm talking about my bird and not me rambling okay out trembly take care of the rest later I am happy to say that somehow I finished this entire list, including the product photos. We started this at what I said, like 9.30, 12.40. I don't know how I did that in three hours. Uh, it's the hyperfixation on getting these sushi bees out because I've worked on them for so long. <laughs> I've waited so long. And now I'm tired, the bird is cranky, and I really don't have any closing thoughts other than thanks for watching. Be on the lookout for when my Patreon opens. And tomorrow, the day you're watching this, these bees will be live on my Etsy. The link is down below. I'm gonna go to bed. The voiceover was probably a lot more energetic than me right now because I'm, I'm just gonna film it tomorrow morning. All right, thanks for watching. Bye.